Good morning, everyone. Sorry, just running just a tiny bit late. I had forgotten to put the title up. <laughs> or I should say change the title for the stream. So I had to end the stream, go back, and all that good stuff. But we are getting situated here. Just got to reop reopen Twitch. and So that way I... No. Oh, why is it doing that? Yes, I know this broadcast ended. That's not the broadcast I'm wanting. Close. That's all that. Okay. Oh my god. I don't know. Look at all these. I don't even know how to get rid of all these pages either. That's the bad thing. Nope. Oh, wait, 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 wait. What was that? No, no. Twitch, come on. And don't... Hang on. Yes, I know. I'm trying to get it so I can. You know, I've got like 20 pages open and I don't know. Wait, like, clear all. There it is. No wonder why I couldn't see it. The stupid word clear all was in white text. And guess what part, what color it was sitting on top of? <laughs> it was sitting on white. Wonderful. Well, everyone, Mary's here. Want to say hi to everyone, Mary? Hello, everyone. All right, let's see. Uh, no, 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 no. Grr, 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 grr. Where is it? Well, Facebook is not aware of my stream starting yet. <sighs> Fine. Let's, well, let's get... Let me get to character and get logged in so it doesn't kick us off. So we're going to continue with Hunts, Hunts in the Deep and I'm wondering did, if I changed I think I just put it in there and I didn't change the episode number. <laughs> oh well. It'll it'll no. di it'll disappear. I won't I won't be able to I don't think I'll know if I'll be able to fix the stream or not. I don't think I can. But let me see. Let me get log uh Logged into the character. What is this? Come on. All right, there's that. Stupid thing. I wonder why I kept feeling vibrations on my phone. It's because of the cable I'm using. Got one of those magnetic cables. Ah. Uh -huh. So just a little tug on it. It's enough to just cause just a. It doesn't like sever the connection, but it's enough of a separation that it will vibrate once it re you know finishes its normal connection. All right, let's see. Uh -huh. Now, before I do anything else, where is I need to find? Well, there's that. Um, let's see if it'll let me upgrade ti titles too. Episode three. Let's see if it'll do it. Please, please, please. Okay. The Grim and Mary Show. <laughs> Not really. I wasn't sure if it would let me change it. Apparently, it it it's going to. So. Yeah, it should be. I've never tried. All right. Next thing is just to look. I forgot to look. Oh, I can see it from here. It's green. So for now we have, for the moment we have a strong stream. Okay. Hello. Yeah. All right. Um, uh, notifications, daily, what is it? Instant all research. I've never used a research uh, doohickey. I haven't either. Ouch. I have missed a lot. I've missed six uh, sign-ins. So far, I can only miss three more, or I'll miss the guar. What was that? I get the guar tomorrow. You get the guar tomorrow? Yep. Nice. I won't get him for a week? A week. Okay, uh, uh, 
We... Would you care to invite Mary? Oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm not used to it. <laughs> um, and plus, usually, you, you usually invite me, so I just, you know, I don't yeah, even think it, about it. It usually ends up with you having to transport to me, which means a loading screen for your viewers. Uh, there you go. And I am transporting over to you. Okay. Watch my cat play with a butterfly. Well, he's done now. I think that's where Mary is. I have no idea. I'm on the loading screen. <laughs> we're going to sit here and we're going to stare at her. Wait a minute. Did I just disappear? Yeah. Yeah, cause it landed me at the way shrine. Ah. Uh, you were. I was sitting at a on a on a kind of a bench thing, at the foot of a bed, and I was. You were going. You if you would have shown up where your your uh, health bar was, you were going to show up about two feet in front of me. <laughs> Fine. Where? Well, let's see. So I'll go downstairs. Uh. I can't remember where it is. Where what is? Where you are. Um. I probably should have looked at my map before I. Um. Well, we're supposed to, we're supposed to be going to uh, Leowin Castle. That's we're yeah, on. I'll a head in that direction. I would say we're on a on a deadly secret. Because you don't you don't feel like doing either. Oh, yeah, I see your little arrow. Your little upside-down carrot, as we would call it. Don't ask me why. But, um... Alrighty. I mean, because if it's, if it's the other way around, and you're, it's used, like, in speech or whatever, they call it a carrot. I'm sure it probably has a, uh, another name, but that's the most common. And I don't know why it's called a carrot. Not an arrowhead. Or something else, but I don't know. But I know you did. You weren't ready to do the uh, thieves' guild or the dark brotherhood uh, quest lines yet. No, because it's technically old content, and we're exploring the new content. Right. Right. Okay. Take it. Yes. It's this way. Mm -hmm. I think. It's kind of looking like it. Yep. That that's that is a pretty nice um, structure. It is. That's what I was going to look at. Uh, set. Getting a little different views for the viewers. Ooh. Oh, look at that. There's somebody up there, way up there at the top. I mean, not on the towers themselves. Uh -huh. Can you see them? Um, currently, just on the UI. Ah. Uh, I can... There's somebody with a with a with a torch walking on the roof. Straight ahead by those well, upside oh. down U shapes. Ah. Yes. See him? Over on the battlements. Yeah, I didn't know what to call those. They're upside down U shapes. Uh, I know things like this cuz I watch a, a guy on YouTube who goes by Shadowversity. Ah. Uh. Shout out for Shadowversity. <laughs> It is really, really pretty. Mm -hmm. And these, I, I, I like these. The decorations on the streetlights, and the, um, the ba these uh, banners or whatever you want to call them, pennants, banners, whatever. Um, I wouldn't have wanted the job to sew pennant. that thing. Yeah, I wouldn't. How would you like the job of sewing that thing? I wouldn't want the job of weaving that thing. <laughs> well, that's what I meant. 
Imagine how long that took. Let, let alone stitching it and yeah. embroidering it, because it would probably be embroidered. Mm hmm That probably took... I don't know, depending, depending on whether they had more than one person working on it. I wouldn't think so. Because I don't think they'd be able to keep stuff consistent. You can really see the scale with you standing underneath it. Yeah. Yeah, that probably would have taken probably a couple of years for one person to do. If not more. I mean, if it, they if they treated it like a full-time job. Yeah. Well, you ready to go in? I am. All right. Uh, what I was just uh, looking at whilst you were looking at the battlements and what and whatnot was um, the new feature. New feature? Yeah, there is a new feature for um, basically th things that you do daily, and you're awarded with uh, Endeavour coins, which you can then use to purchase items that are very similar to what you use actual real money to buy crown crates and things. Ah. And it is available to view under the group UI. Mm. So for me today, I've got the choice of five different dailies. I need to do three. Steal five items from the environment. Craft two items with a woodworking skill. Kill ten bestial daedra. Kill one dangerous foe. Or use an ultimate ability twice. And I believe well, the first mm. time you're, you're actually awarded with gold as well. Mm. Well, I mean, if you want to do those things, I mean, that's fine. I usually don't do da I usually don't do dailies. I mean, I mean, if, you know, not I mean, a, I mean, not in a stream. Yeah, I mean, these are the things that you can do just as as part of your normal day. Yeah, I'm just saying, you know, I know, I mean, normally in. When I'm playing, when I when I'm playing the game, by, you know, by myself, I don't usually don't do dailies. Well, I don't want to say usually. I don't. I did crafting dailies for a while with my main. Mm -hmm. But ooh, I'm gonna talk to Evely first, just because I like Evely. Technically, you were the captain, so you should tell him what we uncovered. No, nope, okay, short, Evely. Short and sweet, but that's okay. A bit like her. I need your report, yep. mercenary. Word reached me that Councillor Jiric was murdered. What about Sophus and Falaria? And did you find definitive proof that the Dark Brotherhood is our culprit? Uh, Councillor Sophus has been murdered too, but Falaria is safe. These notes were by each of the bodies. That's the Black Hand, symbol of the Dark Brotherhood. I wish Jiric and Sophus had allowed me to assign brigadines to protect them. At least Falaria, however reluctantly, Agreed to a military escort. Did you and Evely uncover any other information? We gathered a few documents we think Councillor Leviticus should see. It appears that Councillor Leviticus's trust in the Wood Elf was not misplaced. Very well. You and Evely can head in and talk to the Councillor. Right. Every time I, I see like Evely. Uh, oh, yeah. I, um, I, like, I don't like the green. But I like everything else. I do like the green. Mm -hmm. Every time I see Evely, I think her her it just her first name looks like it's someone just took a word and just scrambled it. <laughs> <laughs> they well, probably did. <laughs> they might have. All right, you ready to go talk to Councillor Leviticus? We haven't been yeah. in here before. No, nope, this is a new area. So we need to see if. Building. Is there anything... Are we going to be able to take anything? Nope, it's stealing. But no, it's all stealing, but there's a bookshelf here. Ooh. I'm going to try to stay away from taking anything that's not worth a hundred or more. Just because I don't know how long it's going to be before you know, we're going to be able to fence it. Okay. 
Sneak, sneak, sneak. Sneak, 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 sneak. Well, I'm not sneaking anymore. I'm just crouched and walking because I've been detected. Who detected me? Oh. That guard. Well, he needs to mind his own business. And... Ooh, what's that up here? Ah. A fast-running hourglass. I happened to see this. I was closing it up. Why would you want that? Okay. Um, yep, I almost forgot. Give it a... I just completed the daily endeavor for stealing five items. Nice. Well, for the moment, the uh, stream is only a couple seconds behind. I'm going to talk to Counselor Leviticus. You must be the mercenary that Captain Rianne told me about. And I see you're working with Everly Sharp Arrow. Good. Good. I assume you have something to report. I'm listening. Counselors Jerick and Sophus were murdered. These notes were left behind, or were left beside the bodies. Damn it all to oblivion and back. I should have taken Faro Lupus more seriously when I received his letter. This is definitely the mark of the Dark Brotherhood. Anything else to add to this? <laughs> I was just thinking, if I was already a member of the Dark Brotherhood, when he said, this is definitely the mark of the Dark Brotherhood, I would want to pipe up and say, yep, made it myself. <laughs> and you know, just see, that would just be, it would have been absolutely hilarious if you could have done that. Ah, <sighs> well, what are you going to do? <laughs> Uh, Jarek and Sophus left behind documents, but part of them is written in code. Yes, that's the Longhouse Emperor's code. Only a handful of Imperial scribes can decipher it. I know one. Baragon. I'll send for him at once. Meanwhile, we must warn the remaining counselors on the list. Abor, Valeria, Itinia, and Vandesia. Uh, Counselor Flaria is under guard and collecting her records from Tidewater Cave. Very good. I've sent messages to Itinia and Vandesia already, as neither of them are currently within Leowin's jurisdiction. I need you to go to Fort Blue Blood. Counselor Abor has taken refuge there, but I'd prefer to have her here in Leowin. Okay, I'll go to Fort Blue Blood and talk to Counselor Abor. Everything we do now must be swift if we are to get ahead of this. Go to Fort Blue Blood and convince Counselor Abor to return to the city. She'll be safer here than at the fort. Uh, you must know more about Emperor uh, Leavik's secret and the ambitions. Sadly, no. Whatever Leavik confided in Pharaoh Lupus and the others, whatever he ordered them to do, he kept it a complete secret from me. I suppose he assumed I wouldn't go along with anything illegal or Daedric, and he was right. But weren't you the chief counselor of the Elder Council? I was, but the Elder Council was made up of almost two dozen counselors. Though according to the list Evely Sharp Arrow brought me, only seven counselors were privy to this secret. Make that six. I, I have no idea why Leovic listed me among that group. Must have been some reason for your name being linked with the others. Who knows what was going through Leovic's head when he wrote that entry in his journal. Varun and his rebels were literally pounding at the doors of the palace at the time. And Leovic wasn't totally in his right mind even before the rebellion. Tell me more about the Longhouse Emperors. The Longhouse Emperors were Reachmen who seized control of the Empire and ruled for some 40 years. Dukaraj the Black Drake founded the ruling house. Morikar ascended to the throne after his father's death, and his son Leovic followed him. Longhouses, that kind of that doesn't sound like something that would be Reachman. That kind of sounds more Nordic. Hmm. Or uh or maybe Orcish. I can't remember. Can you remember what those Orcish 
uh, houses were called in Skyrim? You know, the really weird looking ones? Weren't they called like long houses or something like that? Long houses tend to be Nordic. That's what I was thinking, but. They're, but... they're um, Viking. Yeah. Because wasn't it like the. Wasn't it kind of like they they were called long houses because they just like took their long boats and flipped them over or some something like that, where they looked like their boats or I don't I don't remember. Basically, because it was just one long room, mm. fire pits. Ah, uh, yeah, that's kind of like the way the or orcish homes are in uh, Skyrim. But it's, um, I it's can't... a sensible way of building um, shelter for your townsfolk. True. Anyways, uh, and what happened to Leovic? Leovic made a mistake when he decided to declare Daedra worship as the law of the land, Duke Varen Aquilario subjected. He led a rebellion and personally dispatched Leovic in the Imperial throne room. Thus ended the Longhouse Emperor's reign. I wish I, I almost wish I could, even though it's not an exact quote, I almost wish I could quote Paul Harvey just because of that. But that's not the end of the story. Of course, he says, you know, that's the rest of the story, which I know you're not familiar with, Paul Harvey, Mary. No. Unfortunately, no. I'm, I'm watching disappeared your, uh, a few years your later and the empire collapsed. Ah, that is cute. Now the so-called alliance. Oh, I just sneezed. The sparks flew everywhere. <laughs> Doing all we can just to keep Blackwood safe and secure. Why is Counselor Abor at Fort Blue Blood? Abor has always had an affinity for the Imperial military. When she received her letter of warning from Pharaoh Lupus, she sent word to me, told me she was going to the fort, that the soldiers would protect her. I fear she is badly mistaken. You don't think the fort is safe? Only a token force of brigadines guards Fort Blue Blood. If the Dark Brotherhood is truly our enemy, I fear a lone assassin can bypass the fort's defenses with relative ease. Abor would be better off here in the castle. Go and bring her back at once. All right. Um. Fort Blue Blood. That's to the east, across the river. I'll meet you there. Well, get going, Evelyn. We've got stuff to do. And, of course, I'm not going to be able to steal here because What's-His-Face will see me. What's over uh, here? There are lots and lots of bookshelves. Oh, um, I see a, sh a, sh Ooh, a shiny. shiny. Homesteads in the Black Marsh. Okay, I wish I knew who that was because that little an anvil in in a shrine makes no sense. Uh, Stendhal? Um, uh, could be because I, I could have sworn there was a uh, there's a a uh, Adric prince that has an anvil as yeah, part, well, part of their one symbol. Of the eight is, is um, blacksmith. That it might be Stendhal. I don't remember. I wonder if I could steal from the thing without her seeing me. Something detected me. That's not me. Well, I took whatever it was. A doll. I'm not going to try to pickpocket her. Let's see if I'd be able to steal from this cabinet. Yeah, nothing worthwhile. Oops. Right. All right. Not forty. Ooh. What was that I grabbed? 
It looked like a Nivenese wedding something or other. I think it said wedding pillow. Which I'm not entirely sure what a wedding pillow is. Maybe it's a pillow that the uh, rings are placed on. Yep. That's if I re read that right. Mm -hmm. Okay. They like that word boom in that book. A dragon paperweight. I want a dragon paperweight. Actually, I want dragon anything. I don't care what it, it what it really is. <laughs> I am not stealing a lock pick. <laughs> Can't believe there's only a lock pick in that thing. <laughs> Worth one gold, of course. Let's see. Which it isn't. True. That's what it says. Hmm. Wonder is, is they're only actually worth a gold if you sell them to a fence. That's why I usually try selling to a wall. They're a little bit more solid. I know. Boo! <laughs> Get off the stage! There's a guard just around the corner. Okay. In I'm case not... he's trying to steal from this cabinet here because that is in line of sight with the guard. And it still says I'm hidden. And there's nothing I want to steal. I wish I had the Blade of Woe. I'd take a few people out. And oh, it's just corundum. I'm not gonna take. I'm not gonna take corundum. Ew, white meat. <laughs> Why it's in a cabinet? I don't know. It's just so wrong. Um, a glowy book. Oh, hang on. I have to. I'm at a uh, bookcase. Oh my God. Oh, <laughs> what was? Oh my god, no! <laughs> I'm reg I am really regretting do going slow through this book. Ew, gross! It's a uh, the feast of Saint. Uh, what is that? Quelica, the fourth, and it starts with the fifth course, and it's like Cliff Strider membrane. It says a student strips. <sighs> There's skewered bats. Uh, what does that say? Remen's Pottage, which doesn't sound too bad. But then there's Stuffed Swan, Jellied Beaks, Roasted Camel, it's like Cinch Heart Fillets, and it mentions Marrow and Tendons. It's like, oh my god! <laughs> Remind me never, and I mean never, to eat in this castle. Right. <laughs> I'll just wait till I'm at some bandit camp and eat their spoiled food. Where'd you see a glowy? Ah. Countess Caro's birthday. Ooh, cold chill. That was a big one. Wow. That, um... My, uh, well, if you look in the stream, my uh, kitten is somehow standing on the very edge of the table. Aw. <laughs> I'm wanting to see if I can get him closer to the to the screen. Nope. Come on. He'll probably c come down. Let's see. He stood perfect on the table for me. <laughs> He is right in... <laughs> now look at the stream. Aww. That's a kitty! <laughs> That's a big kitty! 
And you can actually see his, uh, his the pupils of his eyes behind the flames up this close. When he turns his head, you can see it in his left eye. Uh-huh. All right. That's enough goofing. We, we do like cats, don't we? Mm-hmm. What's you, this? You've got, your, you've got your cat. I've got my cat. I've got my banker. Yep. A zombie. A zombie. Yep. Kind of looks like fezzes. Have you got your fezzes? No. I can get fezzes out. And we can compare the two. Uh, collections, um, allies, assistance, fezzes. Oh, no. I thought they did. Oh, no, I know who, who, um, Azabi reminds me of. Azabi reminds me of the, uh, the, uh, drunk mage. I finally managed to find that quest with Morgan. Ah. You didn't pull... Right. No, I was going to say, Fezzes is way the heck over there. I moved over here as far as I could to see if I could get uh -huh. him a little bit closer to, to um, Azabi. He won't move. He is nope. literally... Yeah, Azabi doesn't move either. No, I'm not talking about Azabi. I'm saying Fezzes does, didn't move. Yeah, Azabi hasn't moved either. I went as far away from Azabi as I could. No oh, well. Did I really look in here? Mustache wax. I'm an Argonian. I don't have a mustache. A radish. I definitely am not stealing a radish. Was there anything else? Okay. Somebody just hopped along with a little netch following him. I want the... <laughs> as bad as it sounds, I want the blade of woe so I can start taking people out. I know it sounds bad, but... I will say that I probably should go to a fence. <laughs> I mean, we, we can go to a fence if you want to. Little Argonian being all stealthy-like, and this Imperial just, just going around, yeah. old as brass. <laughs> Hey, no. <laughs> things and looking at them and then, oh, they accidentally go in my bag. So yeah. Maybe she might be a gender. <laughs> Pay no attention to the Argonian skulking around. <laughs> yeah, this is this is why you group up with a party. Oh. Because she will go and chat up the guards. I have to look at that again. That's. Oh, okay. That's not what I thought it said. It says a torch bug, pestle, and mortar. I thought it said torch bug, paste, and something else. I was going to be like, ew! <laughs> ew? Yeah, what God, would you... Yeah. Is it a No, no, it's just Laris. Let's see. No, oh, I'm not going to pickpocket. What's their face? Well, so far so good. The stream is holding really well. Yeah. That that little trick has done the trick. I hope that's it. I don't know. I'm going to have to... Find, oh, there's my little grabber. I'm going to have to turn my uh, ceiling fan down. It's making me cold now. Because I was just... I just looked like I had jumped in the swimming pool with my clothes on by the time I got home. Summer. I hate the summer. I am not a hot weather person. Never have been. Oh, here's a blue. Okay, I'm hidden. It says lead lacquered wooden tone box. Weird. I stole it and there were no sounds. Yeah, I mean, there's still game sounds, but for some weird reason, it didn't make a sound, the, you know, the, the uh, a choir sound or anything. Oh, yeah, we're going this way. Let's see, was there anything in there? Tin, tin of dubbin. Yeah. Instead of just 
otherwise this is just going to take forever. What's over here? Yep. Ooh, wait a second. There's a trunk. What's in the trunk? Palm flask? No. What's that? Oh, great sword. Aw. <laughs> there's there's a uh, ladder leading up to a trap door, and we it's not accessible uh, to us. I can't go up to it. Really? I'm not happy about that. I'd love to go and walk. Oh, you went walk down, up to didn't you? The top of the building. Yes. You know what I would want to do if I was at the top of the building. I regret nothing. <laughs> yep. <laughs> I'd be like, where's Hunts in the Deep? Well, see that big lizard-like stain on the stonework over there? Yeah. Well, that that's him. It's like he jumped off the building. It's like, I'm not going to resurrect him. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna waste this uh, soul stone on his <laughs> on his dumb ass. <laughs> right, go to floor. Oh, um, 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 um. I was just thinking we're probably not near the uh, what's it? Are we? Uh, um, actually, there's there's an entrance not far away. It's just a case of. Uh... Following this road, no, no, I, right, I was, I was, right, and then outside. I was thinking stable master is what I was thinking. Oh, stable yeah, because this yeah, area kind of, is a bit of a way. yeah, because this kind of looked like an area where where someone might place one. Uh, do we want to take a quick trip to the thieves' guild? Sure. I mean, I've got a bunch of stuff that needs to be sold, and so do you. Yeah. It's the only way to get rid of it is with a fence. Let's go and find the back door. And who knows, maybe the uh, those quests will be there. Yeah. And then we, we get it. Certainly pick them up at least, can't we? Yeah. Ooh, there's a Hajmoda. Yep. Great minds. <laughs> I want me some turtle soup. Although, I have a problem. Uh oh. What? One sec. What is that skill? That's four shot. Why don't I have four shot? Because I have a healing staff equipped. Alrighty. Let me know when you're ready. Okay. I'm trying to get her. Let's see. I'm trying to get close to him. All right. I'm going to hit him now. I have a very mad turtle with it's attacking me. Seals of Endeavor. You completed an, an Endeavor and acquired a Seal of Endeavor. Did they use the word Endeavor enough? Um, you can use these seals to purchase items from the Seals of Endeavor section of the Crown Store. Apparently not. Because they just did it again. Uh-huh. They used the word Endeavor like four times. All right. Um, we are headed towards Fort Blue Blood. How far Apparently, away? Apparently that was not a dangerous foe for me. Hmm. Where are we? Where? Uh, oh, we're heading okay. to the Thieves' Guild. Right, 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 right. I forgot already. <laughs> I noticed. Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> Just for that, the antelope has got to die. Aha. Leywen, Outlaw's Refuge. I think it's funny that there's that big grate and they put that big mark on it like no one is going to run across that except members of the Thieves' Guild. Yeah. No one whatsoever. No one is going to have any idea what that symbol means. Right. 
not a, no guards, no nothing. And no one that's not affiliated with the Thieves Guild is going to look at that going, hmm, somebody painted that on there for a reason. I want, wonder what's down there. Uh-huh. And... No quests. Darn. What level are we? I don't know. Level five. Yep, level five. Well, we may have not, not done enough. Yeah, maybe. I see Emily. You see who? We haven't picked, we haven't picked them up already, have we? Oh, We've believe. picked them up already. Have we? <gasps> Meet, yeah. Yes, we did. Meet Quinn at the Windhelm Docks. Okay. <laughs> well, we, 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 hey, we both forgot. Yeah. So don't give me no lip. We both forgot. All right, that's the banker. Yep. So this should be... Nope, that's a merchant. Oh, they have a regular merchant? Yeah. All, all, all the outlaws refugees have a, a merchant and a fence. Well, they should have them right next to each other. Okay, what the flipping heck is the fence, then? Right. Must be this one. There we go. Yep, there he is, sitting on the table like an idiot. Plenty of scheming going on down here, friend. We're up to our eyeballs with schemes. Speaking of schemes, fancy the fruit of yours, eh? He's a wood elf, I think, isn't he? I'm looking at the eyes. He, he looks wood elfish, yeah. Except, aren't, aren't most wood elves, aren't their eyes, like, really big, open, like, you know? Well, he might just be squinting. Could be. Or, or, or scowling. He could be scowling. Nibbanese wedding pillow. I got two of those for a hundred each. That's all I've got to, to sell is just, well, I guess, yeah, I was pretty picky. Uh-huh. Un unlike me. I just take everything that's worth 40 or more. I have to take Morgan. Was it Morgan? No, it's... no, it was um, Shady Way, wasn't it? I have to take Shady Way here. I need to go. I, I'm guessing I probably need to go to the regular. I'm trying to figure out where all this. The regular merchant? I think it's. I'm trying to figure out where all this other stuff is that I have that it says I have. There's a few things, but I don't get it. I've got like 40 out of 65. And I'm like, why do I have all this? Uh, all this stuff. And that was the money lender. Um, your little imp was just having some kind of fit or tantrum or something. Uh huh. Did you see what he was doing? Nope. He was I, either. I tend to ignore him. He's he's a ditzy thing. Yeah, he was either running back and forth or in a tight circle right here at the opening. He was doing it for a good few seconds. Don't um, don't look directly at. I've got plenty of goods to look at instead. Don't look don't look directly at the rabbit. I didn't even notice the rabbit until she said something, and now I can't look at it because that thing's in the way. Oh well, let's see. Um, sell. Ah, here we go. All right, I'm just gonna sell stuff that I am just not going. I need to deconstruct stuff. I'm not gonna deconstruct uh, construct for for a bit. Until I know we're going to be in an area where we can. We're in an area where we can. Eh. Whoops. What's that? Oh. Recipe I have to... I haven't read. that bow for the time being.
That makes a little bit more sense now. Doesn't she look like Quinn? I think she looks a lot like Quinn. Elves all look the same to me. Damn. That's racist. <gasps> you learned how to make rose herbal tea. I'm gonna go look at the rabbit. Even though I'm not supposed to. Bye, die. <gasps> Tell my wife I love her. Make sure it's not a horrible rabbit. Hello, bunny. Cute little bunny, bunny. See if I can get. Careful, it. I do not possess a holy grenade of Antioch. Yeah, a holy hand grenade. I'm getting it, trying to get it in the in the stream. Yeah, or in the camera. It's a pretty, it's a pretty bunny. I wish the rabbits that were out here were um. Were this color? I mean, the ones like outside my apartment, the wild rabbits they're kind of a brownish grayish color they all look the same that's what happens when humans don't interfere i mean some of them are really cute i mean it's that time of the year when you're seeing more and more baby bunnies and the ducks <clears throat> i haven't seen the duck that i called that i call pom pom i haven't seen him in about two years so I'm guessing he might either be an ex duck. Might be an ex duck, because I would I I wouldn't think that he would fly off. You know, when they fly off for the winter, that he just decide. You know what? I'm gonna stay here. You know. Have I, you done it, the thieves girls? Uh, I believe so. Okay. Now we're off to Fort Blue Blood. All right, folks, we're done playing around over here for now. She just vanished. <clears throat> now that's a tree. Look at that thing. Look how high up it goes before there's a single branch. see um port blue blood why is there i don't know why it's showing that that's weird fort blue where the heck is why is it doing that oh okay. god i i kind of know where we're going yeah i um we could take the uh way shrine which we're close to and take it to the well take it to the blue blood way shrine have we, wait, have we actually come, gone over here? I think we, actually, I think we should take the road. Because I, I don't remember, I don't think we've been, been down, down that way. And we don't want to miss the chance of missing a uh, quest giver. I think we have, because we've been over by the uh, Aelid well. Um, mine doesn't look like it, it, mine's still dark. I don't, is yours, or does, is yours lit up, like, uh, you know what I mean, F filled in? Mine's, mine's filled in. Mine's not, so that's why I was questioning it. Maybe because you didn't use it last time. Yes, you used it. That's yeah. right. Well, then let's, uh, do the, um, what's it? The way shrine. The one that we're close to, and then we could take it to the, to the, uh...
Whoops. I'll be I'll be along in a minute. I uh, was going to uh, pickpocket the farmer, and I accidentally attacked him. Oh, I got another endeavor. I mean, don't you hate it when you go to pickpocket someone and you accidentally shank him in the ass? <laughs> Dead piggy, dead piggy. All right. Are you currently kill on site? <laughs> yeah, I actually am. Where'd you go? I thought I saw your arrow. I'm, I'm, I'm at one of the way shrines. Not, not the one that was closest. Mm -hmm. You made it to the way shrine, okay? No. I don't even know where the way shrine is yet. Let's see. Oh, where is it? Oh, I was going, heading the wrong, heading towards, trying to get out. Okay. Let's see. If Hang you on. can't get out along that road, we can follow that road out. Let's see. I'm going to try going this way. Man, he can, he can swim. Whoa. There, let's sheath the weapons so that way if I hear weapons being drawn, I'll know it's not me. And someone's going to try and get me. Is there a... I bet you there's a guard. Is that a guard? Nope. I'm trying to figure my find my way out. Ah, there's a... Here we go. Sneak, 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 sneak. Blackwood. Now, is there a guard right here? Not s Oh, there's a guard. Alright, let's see. Where where am I? Alright, I'm going to head towards a way shrine. Um, you want to kill the Hashimoto? Are you out here? Oh, yep. alright. Yeah, let's kill the Hashimoto. Oh, there we go. Crouch. Crouchy, 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 crouchy. Icker. It's like <clears throat> no turtle meat. Of course, as ugly as that thing is, it probably tastes terrible. It looks, it looks like a turtle. What turtles do they have over there in England? It looks like a turtle. The, the face is turtle-like. Turtle-like? That's like saying, you know... That's like saying, you know, uh, Godzilla is lizard-like. Get with me. There's a uh, what's it up here? A uh, thing, runestone. Yes. Says so there's a flying thing. You are now notorious. Ooh, I see a black. Was that black? Uh, bog dog. Ooh, bog, bog dog, dog bone crusher. Aw. Oh, man, those things are just handsome looking. Clean pelt harvester. There is no way I got a clean pelt off of that thing. Eesh. 
looks like somebody took some kind of big dog and mixed it with an alligator and said, hey, you know, let's smear some moss on it for good good measure. What is that? Where'd that go? Phantasmal discovery awaits. Excuse me? Baking powder? I have to go see what that what that is. Oh, it's some kind of uh, notice on a tree. Did I just go through that tree? Or, or around it? Around it? Or beyond? What is beyond? <laughs> let's let's see. Well, let's just. Hmm? Arcane Archaeological Survey seeks bold adventures for thrilling exper experiment. Ability to yeah. carry heavy magical implements desirable. Bravery in the face of specters, ghosts, and other undead required. For more details, seek out Rivas uh, Demnavani at the ruins of Vyond. Alright, whatever. Okay. Um, we still headed towards... Fort, what's its face? Fort Blue Blood? Yeah. Okay. Just wanted to make sure that's what you still wanted to do. Well, we've had uh, one hour of a successful stream so far. It is barely behind at all. That's what I like to see. Yeah. Ooh. What are you ooing? Cornflower. Oh. You know that was my that, that was my least favorite color in the crayon box. What cornflower? Mm-hmm. It's so pretty. I didn't find it pretty at all. I thought it is. I mean, yes, I know crayons are made out of wax, but it had a very waxy, pale blue look. Oh heck, no! That's not cornflower blue. Well, it is. Cornflower blue is rich. No, not, not, well, then not our colors were. I just remember it was a really bad looking uh, color. It looked, it almost looked, how can I put it? When you used it, it left a lot of um, uncovered area on the, pa on the paper. Uh, are you still Whoa, online? that, no, that is one fast frog. You know what? I'm not the paying nothing. Not an option. Escape is not an option. It's always an option. Keep running. Achievement. Cut and run. Alright, where'd they go? Where'd they go? Not the guards. Look at these guys! These things are lightning quick! <laughs> that is ridiculous! Come on! Move! Go! Don't make me look... Don't throw... Was that you throwing a fireball at the little frog? <laughs> you, you just it was intentionally look. out of range mm. to hit it. Look at these things! Look how fast they move! Oh, they're really quick. <laughs> it's like someone took the travel speed on a frog and amped it up by 10. Mm -hmm. The first time I thought, wow. That's a frog. <laughs> that little sucker can move. Are you going to need a pardon edict or something? Um, I... Because we need to get in here and there is a guard right outside. I mean, I could let him kill me. Let's see, how much money do I have? Oh, I have over six grand. I don't want to wait. I don't want to... I, I pulled wasabi out if you want wasabi. What about wasabi? I brought wasabi out. Run, oh, back! Run! Run! Now, nah, come on, take me out. Go ahead. 
There we go. Ooh, I'm a ghost. <laughs> She'll never know. Look, Councillor Leviticus and Captain Rian sent me. I need to see Councillor Abel now. And what about my sister? She hasn't been seen since she took the Councillor her meal. Councillor Abor was very clear about this. She doesn't want to be disturbed. Talk to Commander... What does it say? Orton? Orton. Yeah. Yep. I couldn't tell if it was Orton or Orlin. Orton. All right. Oh, another mercenary. Is our ivory brigade so enfeebled that Captain Rian must resort to hiring swords? Look, as I told the Wood Elf, Councillor Abor was quite insistent. She doesn't want to be disturbed. Captain Rianne and Councillor Leviticus sent us. Do you really want to get in the way of our mission? All right, enough. I can see when I'm being overruled. Very well. <laughs> I give you permission to enter the watchtower. Councillor Abor's safety is now in your hands. Why is that servant in an uproar? Lurius? Oh, something about his sister. She's another servant here at the fort. Works in the kitchen. Apparently, she brought the counselor her meal. He says she never returned, but the servants look for any opportunity to sneak off. Why did Counselor Abor come to Fort Blue Blood? The counselor demanded we protect her, <clears throat> that her life was in danger, but refused to give me any details. Imperial confidentiality, she insisted, above my station. I put her up in the watchtower and assigned a couple of brigadines to guard her. Brigadines. Those are like miniature brigands. At least that's what I'm going with. Uh -huh. Let's go into the watchtower. Oh no! Councillor Abel has been murdered! But where's the servant? I talked to Lyris on the way in as well. Lyris? Was she out there? Lurius. Oh, Lurius. I thought you said Lyris. I was going to say. What's she doing out there? Abel's meal is still warm. So what happened to the servant that delivered it? That looks poison to me. Nah. I don't know what makes you think that. Maybe the purple mist rising off of it? I just the fact it's got carrots on it. Oh, that makes it poison. Yeah, that makes sense. Counselor Abor's journal. Examine. Oh, okay. Uh, unlike most of the Elder Council, I was in Emperor Leovic's confidence. I knew the truth of the Longhouse Emperor's secret. Most of it, anyway. Me and the High Priest. At the time, it felt like an honor to be included. Now, now I'm in fear for my life and hiding in this damn watchtower. I decided it would be best to write down everything I know about the four ambitions and how they were created. About the deal with Mayroon's Dagon. Everything, um, or everything. I may be the only one who knows the location of the new vaults, well, where Emperor Leovic had the ambitions moved to as Varen's focuses drew closer, or forces drew closer. Um, I suspect that all of this was over. Uh, that it ended with the death of Leovic and the fall of the Longhouse Emperors. According to the letter I received from Pharaoh Lupus, I was wrong. What follows are the locations of the three vaults containing the four ambitions. And it says, the next few pages have been torn out and removed. Of course they tore out the pages and took them. Just as we were so close to finding out more about the ambitions. All right. Mysterious note. And there it is. The Dark Brotherhood's calling card. I wonder if we can... St if we take something, I wonder if e Evely will say anything. Possibly. 
Hmm. It's worth it. I'm just going to find out. She doesn't seem to care. I'm going to try it again. I I don't want to steal a lockpick, but I'm going to do it anyways right in front of her. She could care less, apparently. I kind of had a feeling that's the way it was going to be. Because she's kind of... Well, I mean, she's more than a, than a uh, NPC. She's a quest giver. So I figured she might not, you know, have a hissy fit if I'm going around thieving. Well, there's not much up here to even mess with, so, all right. Not much of a watchtower. Look at this. It's in real bad disrepair. And plus it's got a dead body. I mean, geez. I mean, don't people clean up around here? Apparently not. All right, let's talk to Evely. We have a door locked from the outside, a dead counselor, and a missing servant. Did the assassin take off with both the torn out journal pages and the servant? Anyway, they not only murdered Abel, they probably know how to find the ambitions now. How did the murderer get in and out of the watchtower without the brigandines noticing? See that rope hanging from the top of the tower? No. Bet my bottom acorn that's how the assassin got in and out. The missing servant. Something about that is knocking on the back of my head. And why would the Dark Brotherhood take those pages? Maybe the Dark Brotherhood wants the Daedric weapons for themselves. Maybe. But everything I've read about the Dark we'll Brotherhood right never suggests okay. they would be interested in weapons of war, if that's even what the ambitions are. Damn it. We're loosing arrows in the dark here. Let's tell Commander Orton about Abel. <laughs> just love the way she uses different phrases that's you know more indicative of her kind we have to inform I don't know why I did that counselor Abel's murder I doubt the assassin is still in the fort but you never know plus we need to let him know that the servant is still unaccounted for <laughs> I love Evelyn she's so cute all right is there anything well, there's nothing in here else worth taking We'll just wait for wait for Mary. Shouldn't be long at all. Oh, I'm just happy that um the stream is running well. It looks like it's only like maybe about maybe five seconds behind. And while I'm thinking about it, I need to knock my ceiling fan down a notch. There we go. Oh, goodness. <sighs> Did not sleep well. All right, what do we... Let's see. No scrying. I don't care about scrying. Was that... Oh, I was hoping that was going to get rid of that. Exclamation mark. And it did not. I did touch those, correct? Correct. I know how to make spicy beef salad. That doesn't sound very appetizing. Well... Shoot. How far away am I from my next level? Ah, uh, quite a ways. Quite a ways. Oh, excuse me. Yeah, I only got about a 
about a couple hours of sleep. I'm gonna talk to a zombie just to see what he how how he sounds. Have need of a zombie? This one is here. Oh. Okay, a zombie's female. Definitely a strong female voice. Let's see if there is. Excuse me. Anything in here? Interest. Uh, recipe. Recipe. I'm back. Welcome back. I think. Uh... I was just looking in the bank. To see what there was, if anything, that I could use. And there was a couple recipes. Um, crafting motif. Add, add. That one's already. Add, add. Well, there's no poisons. He's probably... Let's see, is there any poisons he can use? Okay, let's see. Um... Crown lethal poisons. Let's see. Um, all right, let's see. Now we'll go to Did I even grab it? Yes, I did. Oh, that requires rank six. And that requires rank nine. All right, then I'll put those back in the bank. Bend over, a zombie. This one. Your thing's safer with a zombie than in some stuffy boat. Poor kitty. Mm-hmm. Well, I'm not sure how, how else we're gonna put this stuff up. So. Oh, it must be under slotted items. I thought I'd grab more than that. No, that that's just po that's just potions. Did I did I not grab them or did it not let me? Oh wait, it'd be under poison. I forgot about that. That if you don't have poison in your inventory, the poison option doesn't doesn't show up in in inventory. But once you get some, then that's where it goes. It actually brings up poison. There we go. I've equipped poison. So now we can go talk to Commander Orton. If you're ready. Yeah, I am done at the back. Okay. Where is that rope that she that Evelyn was talking about anyways? I want to see that rope. She says, see that rope? It's probably oh, I see it now. I wonder if you can, uh, if you look at it, if it will say anything or just, or no. Oh, is that the rope? Yeah, it's got to be the rope that she was talking about. No, it's just, it's just there. All right. Superhero landing. Going outside. Oh, shoot. Uh, all right, talk to Commander Orton. So, will Counselor Abor be returning with you to Leowin? Am I finally going to be able to get my fort back in order? Counselor Abor has been murdered. Murdered? Gods, keep your voice down. Do you want to start a panic? Tell me what you found in the Watchtower. Abor's meal was still warm but untouched, and the assassin left a calling card. Let me see that. Sign of the Dark Brotherhood. But where is the servant, Talais? Is she involved in this fiasco? And how did she and the assassin get out of the watchtower? My brigadines never left their post. There was a rope hanging from the ceiling of the watchtower. Well, that explains some of it, but not all. 
We need to locate Teles. Since you're already involved in working for Captain Rian, I want you to quietly try to find Teles. Start by talking to the other servants in the kitchen and dining hall. This Brigadine uh, Dorsuo, he's pretty dang sure of himself by that stance. Yep. And I hate to say it, but anybody that's got a weird thing sitting on top of his head that looks like he's probably used to chop lettuce, I can't take seriously. Way to go. Dead drunk again. Dead drunk again. Yep. Alright, so... We have to go talk to servants. Oh, shoot! Oh, she's talking here. I know it. I cannot stop yawning. Oh, the Night Mother's Truth. Hey, well, there's people everywhere. Your sister is fine. This one is certain. Then where could she be? She would never neglect her duties. Probably found a dark corner and someone to snuggle with. This one does that all the time. Okay, Zay Zayheda. Yeah. Pleasant days, visitor. How can this one assist you? Commander Orton asked us to find Talais. Any idea uh, where we should look? Ah, Talais. She worries her brother so. She asked me where we kept the hot root flakes. Counselor Abor sprinkles them on every dish. I told her they are in the pantry, but you need the key from the kitchen to unlock the door. Hot root flakes. Sounds weird. Ah, let's talk to Lurius. Sophie. Commander Orton <laughs> assures me to lace is fine, but it's not like her to disappear and shirk her duties. I worry about her, you know? Since her parents died, we only have each other. Damn it! We have to find her! Okay, now let's see. We need more servants to talk to. Or... Oh. Ah, here we go. All right, grab a broom and start sweeping. What? No, that's Talese's job. And do you see Talese anywhere? No. Then start sweeping. All right, uh, Masaba. <clears throat> the servants come to the kitchen to mutter and gossip. This one will not have it. Misaba asks that you do not distract them overly long as they are already naturally lazy. Mm. What is it that you need? Uh, Commander Orton asked us to locate Talese, or Talese. Any idea where she might be? That young woman. She has not returned from the watchtower, so her chores remain undone. And she took the pantry key with her when she went. It is no longer hanging on its hook. That is a clear violation of the kitchen rules. A clear violation. Where's the pantry? The pantry is in the cellar, but the door is around the side of the building. Teles mumbled something about how the counselor loves hot root flakes, grabbed the key and the tray of food, and went off. This one hasn't seen her since. Well, now. Uh, I wonder. Could I pull that off? <laughs> I just stole the sweet rolls off the table. <laughs> and no one was the wiser. Okay, let's see. Uh, Relique. Uh, Davo? Davo. Yeah. Davo. I suppose now I have to do Talese's chores as well as my own. She owes me one. And I aim to collect. I'm trying to find Talese. Any idea where she, sh where we should look? She took the counselor her meal and hasn't returned. 
Did you check the watchtower? Abor is a little old, but maybe Talaya's decided to improve her station, if you catch my meaning. Abor reeks of fear. Maybe Talaya's finds that attractive. What do you mean the counselor reeks of fear? Well, she's been acting like a frightened war since she arrived. Stays locked up in the watchtower. Only lets a single servant in at a time. And I hear she's been burning papers. Documents of some kind. She's scared out of her wits, if you ask me. Well, I didn't Before ask... Before we check the pantry, let's talk. Mm. All right, Evely. Let's see what Evely wants to talk about. So, what did we learn? Counselor Abor was frightened, but that's understandable. Interesting that she was burning documents. Her journal indicated that she knew more than the others. And Talade visited the pantry before heading to the watchtower. I like the way the firelight um, really brings out the detail in her eyes. Mm -hmm. uh, do you think we should take a look in the pantry? Couldn't hurt. And every mystery novel I ever read taught me you should always follow up on every clue. Even the ones that seem insignificant. Let's check the pantry and see if she was looking for more than hot root flakes down there. Corn. I'm not going to steal corn. Let's see. Don't mind me. They don't even see me. All right, time to go upstairs real quick. See if there's anything worthwhile before we go looking for... Oh, the pantry we have to go outside for. Uh, bookshelf. Ooh, play the... Here's the boom book. Oh, what did you... T what happened? Oh, here's a glow uh, book. I stole a few things. Well, you got caught. And now your imp is fought. Your uh, woman was fighting your imp, and now she's coming after you, I guess. Oh, she ran back up there. I went out of the door. <laughs> <laughs> There's nothing else, is there? Wait, what's down here? Anything? What is that? Oh, those are boots. I'm not stealing a lockpick. There's an advanced chest uh. out here. Ooh. Well, I was going to try to jump over. I'll be right there. All right, where are you? Left. Got the wall. Ah. All right, let's see if we can do this. I think these are the toughest ones. <clears throat> All right, let's do this. Uh, 
Because got it. I've got 19, 19 gold, a lead, a purple lead, Zen Idol. I got a green Breaches of Frostbite, a green Rawhide Boots of Health, and Bronze. Nice. Yeah. I'm... <laughs> I was just say, oh, look, a glowy, but it's your stupid cat! <laughs> Tell him to... Don't you have a dimmer switch on that thing? Nope. <laughs> Fort Blue Blood Pantry. Was she dead too? It's that. Damn it, they murdered Talese too. Nope, somebody Why must. The Dark Brotherhood murder. Oh no. We need to talk about this. Why would they murder her? Because somebody wanted her dead. Plain and simple. Okay. Now, I, how is it that I can search this bookshelf? Ooh, low book. There is no, there's nothing in that first one. Okay, we'll look at this one. On the chamber there's, um, of... Huh? There's a low book. And the one that's <clears> to be out of try. Me. Getting there. Yep, I was summoned by a mortal. That's usually who summons non mortals. Yep, like, bear with me in a moment. Okay. Um, I was trying to think, and well, we all know how that works. <laughs> I'm just, I'm just still so surprised that the stream is only like about five seconds behind. Yeah, that little uh, tweet to OBS seems to work. I'm hope, I'm hoping so. It looks like it, and like I said, I went ahead and I unplugged, and uh, you know, unplugged my router. Because they usually say you should do that every so so often. It's yep. supposed to like clean something out. I don't remember what it what it says it does. All right, I'm gonna talk to Evely if you're ready. Yeah. All right. Yeah, I'm ready. All right. I think I figured it out. The assassin followed Talese down here, murdered her, and took her place so they could gain access to the watchtower. Pretty clever. But they didn't have to kill her. Does Does this sound like the usual way the Dark Brotherhood operates? No, it does not. No, not from what I've read anyway. I thought they only killed those whose names appeared on their contract. Exactly. I can't imagine anyone asked them to kill a poor servant. Oh, I've killed a, I killed a servant when I was uh, playing Skyrim for the Dark Brotherhood. Somebody yep. somebody wanted her dead. Yeah. It was that... Uh, it, it was only with a contract, though. So. Mm-hmm, only with a contract. Why would, why would they have a contract for this servant? They, it's, I don't know, maybe, maybe somebody didn't like her, or maybe somebody's framing the Dark Brotherhood. That's what I would be thinking. Mm -hmm. Should we return to Lewin and inform Counselor Leviticus and Captain Rion? Yes, but we still need to check on Counselor Falaria, and someone needs to go to Gideon and make sure that Counselor Vandacia is alright. Can I leave those tasks to you? I want to return to Lewin and consult with Counselor Leviticus. I love that name, uh, uh, Vandacia, or v Vandacia. Vandacia. Yeah. It's got really pretty sound to it. Even though I can't say it. <laughs> I can check with Flaria and what's-her-face, or what's-their-face, Vandacia. <laughs> but we Vin also... Diesel. Yeah, Vin, yeah, and Vin Diesel. Yeah, there we go. I can check with Falcon and Vin Diesel, but we also need to inform Commander Odin about this killing. <laughs> oh, good point. Before you head out, report to Commander Orton. Tell her what happened to Talese, and how we think the assassin slipped into the watchtower undetected. 
His brigadines need to be able to recognize an imposter when they see one. I was just thinking, Commander Orton, like Randy Orton, like the wrestler. If I go out there and tell him that somebody died, he may like RKO me right there under the rocks. That uh -huh. might st might sting. Hmm. I'll report to the commander. Uh, contact the two remaining counselors and then meet you in Leowin. After you report to the commander, make contact with counselors Valeria and Van Dacia. Valeria went to Tidewater Cave to get her records, and Van Dacia works in the Gideon Courthouse. Cracked acorns! I suddenly had the weirdest feeling come over me. <laughs> Cracked acorns! <laughs> Emily, are you alright? Yes. No, I don't know. We were talking about the counselors, Valeria and Vandacia. Suddenly I had a premonition. It was brief and disturbing and mildly unpleasant, like the dreams I've been having. But this is the first time while I was awake. Hmm. I didn't know she could do that. Tell me about the dreams. Remember I told you about that strange book I found? The one with the Daedric writing that I can't read? I've been having bad dreams since I found it. And the dreams are becoming more frequent. This time it happened right while we were talking. Tell me about the premonition. It was just a flash, but it was accompanied by a feeling. I felt a sense of overwhelming evil, all tied up in the figure I saw in my mind. Like someone held a portrait in front of my face for just a moment and then pulled it away. What did the figure look like? It was one of the waking flame cultists, I think. Someone powerful, in command. A dark silhouette wrapped in a cloak. I'll never forget the feeling it invoked. It was like a wave of hopelessness. We can deal with this later. Let's get back to it. All right, so now we get to go talk to the commander. Oh, commander! Anything in here worthwhile? Oh, no! They did not know how to build stairs. It went right into the ceiling. Um, yeah, I'm not going that way. I've yeah. got one gold left on my bounty. So I'll be clear in three minutes. Alright. What? Uh, don't get snotty with me, little Miss Blackwood Guard. There's somebody down there with a one gold. You darn well, there is not, not a, probably not a guard anywhere that would care. <laughs> They'd be like, you're bothering me for a one gold bounty? <laughs> They're like, I'm going to arrest you just for wasting my time. <laughs> I'll wait until you get over here and then we'll talk to the commander. True cold chill. <laughs> I just heard, I just heard a fem a female, um, out there somewhere going, "That's what he said." <laughs> it's like so we're doing that's what he said jokes now, huh? It's like all righty. should be okay to approach and talk to him, shouldn't I? You should, but I mean, if you get if the guard catches you, it's one gold. And uh, oh yeah, stolen. <laughs> right, right, right. Yeah, that's that's the that's what we don't want. So yeah, I mean, just... one more minute, I should be clear. All right. Oh, you're right. Boy, you snuck all the way around. And I don't think that guard goes anywhere. So you so you should be all right. I think. Yeah, that's just a brigadine. All right, I'm going to talk to the commander. All right. You talked to the fort servants and rummaged around in our pantry. What's the verdict? Did you find the missing servant? Talese is in the pantry. The assassin murdered her. Pretended 
pretended to be her to get into the watchtower. That's... Oh, that's horrible. Are you sure? No. Of course you're sure. No one would lie about something like that. I'll tell her brother what happened and send someone to tend to her body. Gods, what a day this has been. <laughs> now I'm standing. <laughs> that's what he said. <laughs> what sh I don't know who's saying that. It sounds like it's coming from down this way. I don't know. Is that a guy or what's well, it? Oh, it could. It could be. It could be her. Agbava. She could be the one saying it. I don't know. It makes sense because it sounded like it was coming from the same layer of space, uh -huh. both times. And ooh, wind racer. That's a nice name for a horse. Yeah. Hey, you know, pretty horse. Ooh, look. There we go. Just the right angle. His eye almost glows. There it goes. Oh yeah. I like it better when it's darker. It doesn't look so creepy. <laughs> All right, uh, we have to go warn. We have counselors to warn. We've got about yep. 20 minutes. And then I'll, I'll close the stream. I'll <laughs> throw some burritos in the microwave so that way I can eat something. Because <laughs> so I haven't eaten since lunch, and that was... Let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six... Seven, almost eight hours ago. Yeah. Yes, thank you. I am well. <laughs> no, I have no monkey. Thank you, Mr. God. Right. <laughs> I see a way shrine. Yep. Blackwood Crossroads. If you're courageous enough, all things are possible. Oh, there was that weirdo. Oh, the, uh, the prestidigitator? Yeah! I ran out of stamina just shy of the way shrine. Ho, ho, ho. It's kind of an interesting cart. I wonder what they keep in there. It's got a small square door. It's definitely different. Yeah. Apparently, it's it, it looks like it's somewhat important. Possibly. Yeah. I don't know what it is. Oh, well. Um, I'm gonna look at the map. See what, where the heck we are. What's going on? We're All right. going this way. You're going which way? That way? Okay. We're going this way. Okay. Do 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 do. Squirrel. I love how it leaves little glowy paw prints. Right. Hey. Shades of the old days. Lion butt. Lion butt. <laughs> Lion butt. <laughs> and for everyone else that's watching this, no idea what I'm talking about. Back in the days when Mary and I used to play... Uh, Latro or Lord of the Rings Online, uh, she would lead a lot of times, and well, you know, you rode horses, and she would be in front, and she would just, you know, would jump over fences and whatever, and I just happened to be just close enough to her that all I ended up with was a screen full of horses' butt. And so I ended up telling her that, and 
from then on, every time she jumped, she would say, horse butt, horse butt. And I started doing that too, and it just kind of became a thing. Yeah, I see it. Yeah, so it just kind of became our thing. And if we wrote a different animal, then it was a different butt. <laughs> Author's assistant wanted. It says Gideon. Let's see. The Ghost Rider of Giovesi, I guess. Jeez. All right, let's see what it says. Author seeks well-muscled and energetic assistant to help research local history. Applicants must be willing to traipse around in swamps and possibly haunted ruins. Peerless martial skill and Daedra make uh, and Daedra may care attitude required. It said devil may care, it's Daedra may care. Nice. Positive outlook and cheery disposition desired. Don't mess, don't mess. Don't miss out on this lucrative opportunity. Please direct all inquiry, inquiries to Yasara of Sentinel at the Egg and Hammer Inn in Gideon. Why would you call an inn the Egg and Hammer? Positive, no idea. Positive outlook and cheery disposition. We need to have. We need. We would need to have like a really, really big character, make him look as mean and as evil as possible. Have him just kind of walk Stay up. Stay away from that guard. She's got the lurgy. She's got the lurgy, huh? She's got the lurgy. She sneezed just after she walked past me. Mm. Uh, there is a way shrine mm. and a stable master in here. Mm. I was gonna say, maybe, maybe she's got corona. What's that? Oh, that's that spot we're supposed to go. I'm uh, heading to Way Shrine and Stable Master. Okay. No, you're just kind of sitting there. <laughs> I was waiting for you. Oh, there's another quest over there. Yep. Let's see. Again? Ferric Gemin or Gamain? Or Jemain, I guess it could be. Let's go. To, I'll, I'll pick it up in a second. I want to. You went to the stable master, and that's where I want to go to. Uko. All sorts of mounts come through Gideon. I stable even the most unique, and I sell a few of the more common ones. If you're interested. It sounds like she needs a little primatine. All right. What do we want? Huh, speed. <laughs> All right, let's talk to him. Look, I've got just as much right to stand here as anyone else. If those scantily clad Debellites want me to leave, you tell them to come out here and say it to my face. Wait, there are scantily clad Debellites? Where? Wait, Debellites, what are you talking about? You're not one of their sanctified bullies? Oh, that's a relief. Call me Farrakh. I came to Gideon to clear my family's name, but the loose robe fanatics in the Dibolosium want to run me off. Started with dirty looks. Now I'm getting threats. Dibolosium, there's a word. Uh, why exactly are the Dibella worshippers trying to get rid of you? They think my Grana Cerise murdered their high priest decades ago. It's not true, and I mean to set the record straight. I take a little snooping around, but the evidence is here. I know it. Want to lend a hand? Don't have much, but I can pay. Yeah. Yeah, sure. I'll help with your investigation. Thanks for the help. Not easy for Jemaines to make friends around here. The Debellites use that manse in the center of town as their Dibolosium. Sort of a consecrated love nest. If there's proof of Granis' innocence in Gideon, we'll find it there. Consecrated love nest, huh? I'm on my way. <laughs> Tell me more about this murder. Like I said, the victim was one of the Debellites' high priests, a woman named Rolaine. This was 60 years ago, my. But my grandfather tells me the locals worshipped the ground she walked on. Thought she was a prophet, or something near to it. And the people blamed your grandmother for her death? Aye. My Grana Cerise was Rolaine's flower bearer. Followed her everywhere oh, she went. Oh, my old buddy uh, Mac is watching. 
Anna was the prime suspect. On a Facebook no Live. Hey, Mac. Point. You're still there? Found her. It's good to see you. Hope you're doing well. Uh, your grandmother disappeared? Like wood smoke in a windstorm. And without breathing a word to my grandpa Lier. Way grandpa tells it, neither of them would so much as visit the loo without telling the other where they were headed. But the locals wouldn't listen. You know, I'm just thinking, I don't think I have ever heard anybody mention going to the loo before in this game or in Skyrim. It's nice to hear a local phrase. Yeah. <laughs> well, yeah, local phrase. Yeah, because Bethesda's over there. All right. Uh, what happened to your grandfather? These damned zealots rallied half the city. Gathered up torches and shovels and ran him and my father out of town with nothing but the clothes on their backs. Even outside of Gideon, the rumors followed him. We haven't had a moment's peace since. You said you're not from around here. Where did you travel from? Bravo. It's been an awful long time, but with the Three Banners War and all. But I made it, and I'm not leaving till I settle this once and for all. Is it that important? Why come all this way to solve a 60-year-old crime? Might have happened yesterday for all these people care. Nobody holds a grudge like an Imperial. If your name is Jemaine, you're lower than dirt in their eyes. I just had a son a couple years back, and he's already catching it on the chin. He's two. So you think clearing uh, Cerise's name will earn you an apology? An apology? <laughs> I'm not that naive. I'm a carpenter by trade. I'll settle for people not hiding my tools and splitting my sawhorses six times a month. It's about respect. To oblivion with the rest. Do you have any evidence your grandmother was innocent? I... Well, not exactly. For now, I can say I have good reason to think there's more to the story. I'll know more once we look around their makeshift Temple of Debella. But I'll feel much better about doing that having you with me. Alright, so we have to... Escort. Um, hey... Did they forget what escort means? <laughs> Apparently. They're going to escort him into the escort's place. Right? <laughs> Temple of Debella. Well, there's something you don't see every day. I'm not entirely sure how he pulled that off, but that was kind of... He's... Oh, I was going to say, where did you go? You're crouched. He's taking it. He's taking a helmet and putting it on and off. The, the, I mean, the only bad part is his, horn, his outer horns are getting in the way, and he shouldn't be able to get the, the helmet on his head. But that's beside the point. I've never seen an NPC do that. Remove a piece of uh, a piece of armor. Well, well, Black Fin Legionnaire. Wonder who the Black Fins are. And don't tell me they're Legionnaires. I know that already. I mean, I've never heard of them before. Kind of like uh, the uh, Shadow Scales, you know, are the Argonian version of the Dark Brotherhood. Let's see. These are some big bookcases. Let's see if there's anything in the backpack. Mm. Ironwood Nut Sav Jar. Well, I don't know what Ironwood does, but... No, I don't know. I might need some. Might need some sand for my my lizard nuts. It was worth a hundred gold, which it, whatever it was. Should I get? I got false teeth collection. <laughs> wow! How do you how, how would you acquire that? 
Or how would you start that collection? That would be really awkward. I probably talk to the Dark Brotherhood. <laughs> if you kill some people and they happen to have dentures, could you just like, you know, give them to me maybe? I don't think you'd want to walk around and ask people. Hey, you done with them teeth yet? Ferric, you're in the way. That's a nightstand. Ah, it's just got, got ore in it. I don't really care about ore. So, this is the Divilosi. Just what I expected. Let's see. I've got to find a place where I'm not detected. Are you stealing? You did not saw me stealing because I hadn't stolen anything. And this is a bookshelf, anyways. And it says I'm hidden. Of course, that's just for the bookshelf. The cabinet's empty. Ah, uh, Amal's. Looks like I can't s steal anything mo more with him watching me. So, let's see. There's another, uh, thief in here. Skeever Tail Stirring Stick. Oh, gross! What is wrong with these people? I mean, out of all the things to make a stirring stick out of, why would you want to have it made out of a skeever tail? I've no idea. That sounds horrific. Uh, that's the exact word I was going to use. Was horrific. Ooh, a, ser a serpent's tongue doily. I'm hoping that doesn't mean it was made out of serpent's tongue. Ooh, this armor is sweet. I like his pet. Yeah, kind of a green dragon. Or actually, it's more of a. All right, that's a. Well, it would. They think it. They think it's a dragon, but it's not. It's a wyvern. Because it only has two legs. If it has two legs... I am ready to talk to Farrick. I have a second. If it has two legs, and the wings are part of its front arms or front legs, then it's a wyvern. If it has four legs plus wings, it's a dragon. If it has four legs and no wings, I believe it's a drake. All right, I'm gonna talk to Farrick. Oh, look at this place. These Debellites fancy themselves free-spirited bards blown by the wind. They've got enough gold to make Zenithar blush. Ah, it doesn't matter. This is where we'll find our answers. What do you imagine we'll find here after all these years? I don't know yet. I just know we have to look. Take this. It's a rare bit of magic called a memory stone. Grana Cerise gave it to Grandpa Lier the night before she supposedly murdered Priestess Rolain and fled. Maybe it'll show us something. <laughs> What's a memory stone? <laughs> I'm a carpenter, not a mage. But according to this dark elf I showed it to, the mushroom wizards up in Morrowind use them to store their memories. The catch is you have to stand where the memories occurred to wake up the magic in the stone. So, you believe that if this memory stone holds memories made here, it will activate? Aye, that's the hope. I know we face long odds on this. Magic stones and lost memories sound like storybook nonsense, but it's really all I've got to go on. How about we start our search on the ground floor? Hmm, somebody else popped into Facebook Live. Who got... 
Oh, Shannon. Uh-oh, I mean Slacker. <laughs> Shouldn't you be working? <laughs> I'm glad you're here, Shannon. I appreciate it. Uh, let's see. Can you give me the details of the crime again? Like I said, the victim was one of the Dvelite's high priests. A woman named Brolaine. This was 60 years ago, mind you. But my grandfather tells me the locals worshipped the ground she walked on. Thought she was a prophet. Or something near to it. Alright, um... Goodbye. Alright, so... Going, looks like, downstairs. Do, 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 do. All right. Are you hearing that? It's kind of a weird humming sound. Look, the stone flashed. Did you see it? Try here. It. Hmm? Use mem. Wait. Use memory stone. Something's happening. It's a memory. Who is that? Laura's mercy. All he had to say? I'll talk to him in a second. We've got big bookshelves. Have you not already looked at the bookshelves in here? I don't remember. I probably did. <laughs> oh, yeah, I did. Never mind. I just thought this was a new room. All right, I'm talking to Ferret. By the eight, what was that? A murder? Someone recorded a murder in that stone? Why would anyone do that? Wait. Could this be related to the disappearances Grandpa Lier told me about? Disappearances? Aye. The way Grandpa Lier tells it. In the weeks before Rolaine vanished, a handful of novitiates went missing. None of them were popular enough to raise an outcry. People said they must have just left, trying to get out from under Rolaine's shadow. Is it just me, or does him saying I sound kind of out of place? I. <laughs> <laughs> 10,000 comedians out of work, and you're trying to be funny. <laughs> You said your grandmother was Rolaine's assistant. Did she know these, uh, novitiates? Yeah, <laughs> novitiates. Grandma Cerise helped all the novitiates. Cleaning linens, tending the flowers, arranging sheet music. She knew everyone. These people probably would have pinned the disappearances on her, too. The story took a dark turn after Rolaine's murder. Dark turn? What do you mean? The Develites decided it must have been a conspiracy. Mm. The missing novitiates were all in on the plot. Now we see the truth of it. Can't be sure, but whoever murdered those novitiates might have murdered Rolling too. We should keep investigating. All right, let's see if the stone resonates anywhere else in the uh, Dibalasium. Yeah, Dibalasium, or something like that. Explore the second floor. Okay. Mm -hmm. Do, 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 do. And I think we already. Oh, I see one. Another flash. Try the stone now. Not another one. You did preserve me. <laughs> so real. That was almost a blade of woe killing. It was a blade of woe killing. As was the first. Well, the, the, that, that second one wasn't... Uh, they, they kicked the feet out. I haven't seen that one. I know that if you do a uh, blade of woe, you come up behind them and grab their ankles and jerk their feet out from under them. Ew. Small game in a cabinet. Let's see. All right, explore the top floor. Wait, what is that? Oh, the shrine. I guess that's the shrine of Debella. That would make sense. I don't remember what her shrine looks like. It's 
been too long. All right, I'm gonna go upstairs. Do, 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 do. Mm -hmm. Little bookshelves. Crouch. Backpack. Nope, nothing I want. Sneak, 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 sneak. sneak. With disaster, friend. Uh, apparently, apparently, I'm flirting with disaster. Well, you red meat in a cabinet. People are sick. A child's drum. Obsidian. Let's see. And there it is. Maybe. There's too many people in here. There we go. Use use memory stone. It's our killer again. What's he doing? God, what is that? Magic? Did you see those gestures? Can you repeat them? I didn't even. I could barely see it. Let's see. Activate the suspicious wall. Simple stitching all. Okay, I thought it said simple stitching anvil. I was going to say, what the hell is that? <laughs> Alright, let's see. Suspicious wall. How is it suspicious? Mom, Yipe! <laughs> Yipe! <laughs> Use the phantom door. Um. <laughs> no? It's making weird noises. Keep it together. He's gonna puke, isn't he? Yeah. Sure sounded like it. Crude map. Oh, I guess we'll just take it. Examine the crude map. Well, that means I have to go into my inventory. Go to quest items. It's not giving me an option to look at it. That was weird. Oh well. Ledger of Souls. Oh, this is short. Uh, fellow members of the of the Waking Flame, I have acquired three new souls for the Ideal Masters. Oh wow! I haven't heard that those names in a while. Yeah. Alas, I have exhausted my supply of Black Soul gems. I will need to acquire more gems if our relationship with the Ideal Masters is to bear fruit. For uh, bookkeeping purposes, I have acquired the following souls. Novitiate Cl Clara Astir. Novitiate Ariel Athene. Novitiate uh, Edgard Gain. Uh, even now, rumors of the Novitiate's what does that say? Perfidy. Perfidy? Perfidy. I, don't even, I don't even know what that word is. Vicious perfidy are circulating through Gideon. The souls I acquired were uh, dissatisfied with their lives and removed coins from the Dibalasium treasury. A simple deception, but the ignorant citizens of Gideon will swallow it quite easily. The harvest will continue. You have my word for the waking flame. Ah, the ideal. What did he say? I think he said he was going to be sick. No. Um, yeah, the ideal masters. That's, uh... Oh, what is that? What is that area called? It's 
when it's when yeah. you it's when you die and you don't have a soul because you're because you were you're you were soul trapped. There's a thing in in Skyrim where you actually go there and you can see the ideal masters or one of them. I, oh god, what is that? What is that called? What is that area called? Can you look it up, Mary? I'm looking it up. I had a feeling you were. I'll probably just uh, look up uh, Skyrim Ideal Masters. And it should probably tell you that they're like the lords over something. Or the rulers over something. The Ideal Masters were once mortals and formed an early order of sorcerers who practiced necromancy. Trafficking in souls, great, small, and fragmentary. They became very powerful and eventually found their physical forms to be unacceptably weak and limiting. They transcended those forms and became be beings of soul energy. But it doesn't actually tell me where they are. Let's have a look at Dernabir. That's the dragon down there. Soul Cairn. The Soul Cairn, yes! The Soul Cairn. Yes, yes, thank you. Yeah, because you go into the Soul Cairn in, uh, in for a short time. Yeah, in Skyrim. And you yep. get, the, uh, get the special mount. Right. Right, I'm going talk to talk to Farrick. Alrighty. What have you got there? A letter? Here, let me have a look at it. Oh, and can I have my stone back? I think I've had my fill of grisly memories for now. Sure, it looks like a ledger. Watch him? Clara, Ariel, Edgard. Yes, these were the novitiates. This should bring their families some closure, at least. Okay, I'll talk to Farrakh again. It wasn't enough that the murderer killed the novitiates. She had to steal their souls, too? How would someone even do that? The person who wrote the ledger mentioned black soul gems. Huh. I've heard of soul gems before, but not black soul gems. I thought mages just used them on rabbits and goblins and such. These black ones can suck up the souls of men and myrrh? They preserve us. The ledger said the killer traded them, right? Yes, or they intended to, to a group of mages called the Ideal Masters. Ooh, this was this was when the ideal masters were still had physical bodies. Ooh, that'd be cool. Never Maybe. heard of them, but then again, honest carpenters like me don't do much business with soul stealing wizards. It's all academic anyway. There's no way of knowing if the trade even took place, unless that map you found contains a clue. It points to a location in the swamps far east of Gideon. Hmm. I never told you how Priestess Rolling died, did I? She left to visit Leowin in her carriage, along with her flower bearer, Cerise, my grandmother. They never arrived. Maybe this map shows where they went. Let's see where it leads, eh? Um, if no one recovered uh, Priestess Rolaine's body, how was your grandmother convicted of her murder? Grandpa said there'd been talk about how Grandma Cerise and the other junior priestesses of Debella were greedy. When news came that Priestess Rolaine had been murdered, none questioned they'd killed her. Instead burned Grandpa Lier's home. They had no one to blame for the murder and needed a scapegoat. I don't see how it could be anything else. Sadly, I imagine the angry people who burned down our home and chased Grandpa Lier away are dead now. So they're beyond justice. Yet we can still clear my grandmother's name. We must for Grandpa Lier. <laughs> he says he's never heard of him. We're going to ask who are the, these ideal masters. Yeah. That's what he says. You're asking me? I figured you'd know. Whoever they are, I guess they like souls. The ledger said that the killer was bringing black soul gems to trade for a reward of some sort. Maybe they're part of the Waking Flame cult the killer mentioned? Perhaps. I've never heard of the Waking Flame cult. I wouldn't expect you to know about them. How many local cults are you familiar with? You seem so calm about all of this. So, these Waking Flame folks are still around? 
our killer was one of them, that means they've been in Gideon for decades. Maybe they're the ones that stirred up the threats against you to keep you off the scent. By the egg, I hope not. I can't imagine how horrifying it would be to die, but not die. To be trapped forever in one of those black soul gems. Just thinking about it makes me feel like I want to vomit. I'm so glad I have you to protect me. Oh, believe me, you wouldn't be in the soul in the trapped in the black soul gem forever. You would be used. Trust me, you you're considered energy. Yep. If no one ever recovered Governor uh, Rolaine's body, how, how, oh yeah, we already did that. So goodbye. Um, I say we we come out of this room before we uh, end the stream. Because this is like a portal thing, and Lord knows what that would uh, that would do. That was weird. Someone just killed somebody. I heard yeah. the sound. I heard the sound. That was I heard, the that I heard the squishy sound of the blade of woe. Steel entering flesh. Yeah. I just wanted to check what that was. All right, where'd you go? Right behind you. Oh, sneaky. Oh. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> Superhero landing with broken ankles. Wee. We can at least. Hello. Let's just get to the ground floor. Where are we supposed to go? Right there. What is it? What is it? Nothing. Stop asking me. What is it? Um. I'll say we just uh, end the stream here. Okay. Because it's quarter after, and like I said, I still need to get something to eat. Yeah. And then we'll then that'll give us maybe about maybe about an hour that we can that we can play on our the new tunes we created. Yep. <sighs> All right, folks. Well, that's gonna do it. I'm happy that the stream has been just it ran great. I mean, it did not look like it was more than like five seconds behind. So. No, it's Let's, kept up really well today. Yeah, I mean, better than I mean, usually when a when the stream's running well, it's like about what? Maybe 10, 20 seconds behind. Yeah. So yeah, you can't you can't get better than that than this the way this one ran. So I'm really happy about that. Hopefully it's it keeps doing that. But anyways, folks, that's going to do it. Oh, goodness, sorry. I'm just sleepy. I only slept for about two hours. But anyways, that's going to do it for uh, today, folks. Our second episode of the new content. <laughs> Bye, Mary. <laughs> <laughs> and um, that's going to do it until until Wednesday when we have our uh, when I have my normal stream. Which probably, probably Barry will poke her head in if, uh, depending on what time I get done. I, I. Oh, that's right. I, You're uh, off. I forgot hey. about that. Yeah. So, <laughs> we don't know what time Mary will join the stream. All depends on what time I decide to start. If I start it at my normal time, she may be with us the entire time. We'll just have to see. Way to go, Mary. You're making a mess. And you landed in it. Smooth move, x lax <laughs> Anyways, folks, that's going to do it. So, another stream down. Mary showing off. Playing with her mementos. <laughs> but anyways, that's going to do it, folks. So, I'm going to go ahead and get ourselves logged off. And she's dancing behind me. She's drunk, folks. That's just all there is to it. She's drunk. <laughs> all right. Signing off. <laughs> all right. Let's see. Get myself to right there. Oh, yeah. The numbers are still high. I mean, I'm looking at it. It's green running at 6,100 kilobytes per second. Nice. So, yeah, the stream did very, very well. I'm very, very happy. Anyways, folks, like I said, that's going to do it. I um, hope you had a good time. I uh, want to thank uh, 
my friends Mac and Shannon for hopping in the, the stream on uh, Facebook Live. Um, I appreciate you coming in and watching for as much as you did. Um, if you two haven't already, uh, I'd appreciate it immensely if you if you'd go to my uh, Twitch page and uh, give me a follow. Doesn't cost anything, and it helps me out, get me closer to uh, my goal of well, my first goal of fifty, which is uh, what I need to be able to become affiliate. And so I believe once it's after that, I can start possibly uh, monetizing slightly. And um, every little bit of that's going to help. <laughs> so, anyways, thanks again, folks. And I hope you'll join, uh, well, join both Mary and I uh, Wednesday uh, for the regular stream, I guess you can call it. <laughs> yep. So, anyways, that's going to do it, folks. Thank you once again uh, for for joining me, and see you Wednesday. So take care, everyone. <laughs> Bye, everyone. But, see you later. Take care. Keep cool in this heat. <laughs>